Hello, it's good to see you again. So I'm doing a review today on the concert I attended with Gorgatron, Carnographer, Fluxamuck, and Parthian. So Parthian is a band out of Wichita, Kansas, and they were the opening band of this concert, and that was amazing. It was hosted over at Dr. Jack's um, on the 29th of October, and it was um, the producer for that was um, Blackheart Booking or um, Carazin Negro or um, Lucas. So I am bringing to you my experience of this show, and it was an amazing show. It was death metal. I had such, I partied so hard that I ended up breaking my phone. Um, it was knocked out of my hand a couple of times. I dropped it once, and it just, thanks to all of that, it broke. But now I have a new account on Facebook, and now I have um, a better screen to actually bring you um, different reviews and materials. So I'm excited about this, and it, um, this concert was just amazing. This show was amazing. So this was the first time um, hearing Carnographer and Gorgatron in person. I've heard Floxamuck before, um, and I'll tell you about that one. That one was an interesting experience. Um, so it was the first time hearing Kyle Herndon's voice in person, and oh my gosh. I've heard Gorgatron and um, Carnographer um, through YouTube, but this was the first time that I've actually heard them outside of my own speakers and got to hear the real experience and um, feel the music. I got to feel that. That was amazing to me. I had so much fun. It was so it was so exciting. There was even a mosh um, happening, and it was great. Um, I. People were jumping around and stuff, and um, I somebody bumped into me. I almost got knocked over, but somebody was right behind me, held me up. I love just the um, uh, etiquette we have in our community when it comes to moshing. Everybody's so awesome. Everybody looks out for one another when it's happening, and that's just some quality that our community really um, brings to the table and brings to our events, and I thought that was amazing so um lucas uh, that night was also the sound guy so he was doing a lot of different things that's um black heart booking that's the producer so a shout out to lucas you are incredible um also i because of my phone breaking right i was getting some different videos i did get a clip that i sent to my story on my other account but that was only a clip when I broke my phone for some reason it didn't load to like the cloud or anything so that was sad I lost those videos but Craig the lead singer of Gorgatron looked right at me several times I had amazing pictures of Coop Shoe um, of Paul and um, I don't know the drummer's name and I apologize um, I will get to that uh, I will be asking questions, so be prepared for that. If you are watching this, I'm going to be asking you guys questions so that I can get all of this right and get all of your different members' names and get all of the different local musicians because you are incredible and um, the community deserves to know you and you deserve to know them. So I, I just really loved that experience just feeling that music was completely different from what I hear on YouTube and also I got to hear the um version I got to hear um Agony Reborn that is um Gorgatron's new release before I even heard it on this cassette that I ordered and I ordered on, um, so I ordered a cassette and I also ordered Gorgaton coffee, so we can look forward to all of that. And they had some different merch there, and unfortunately, I couldn't afford the merch at the moment, but I look forward to seeing you all again in different concerts and really um, uh, 
purchasing merch and um, benefiting our musicians because you are amazing and you deserve to survive and thrive in this community, in this world, in this lifetime. So you are amazing. But I just, I loved the um, personality. I loved the interpersonal communication of these different musicians. I loved that um, Craig looked at me several times in that recording when I, and when I was taking pictures and just made eye contact with us as an audience. I love that. I am looking forward to going to another concert so that I can get that experience again and that I can actually get a good picture of you, good videos, and I can really bring that to our community because, and I can show all of you because it was an amazing experience. The, the expressions on Craig's face were fucking amazing. And I wish that I had, um, had a better angle of um carnographer because then i could have actually had like um uh kyle herndon's um expressions as well because you're amazing thank you that was amazing and um coop shoot the only thing that i would have changed about this is that um at dr jack's i noticed the this inside stage I've had, uh, I've experienced concerts outside, um, and the outside stage, I kind of prefer a little bit better than this inside stage, um, because the inside stage, the speakers are blocking some of the musicians, and I don't care for that, because I really like enjoying, um, watching the guitar players and the bass players, and I really enjoy watching what they're doing with their hands, and how how what they're doing with their hand is affecting the sound of the music and it it just adds to the entire experience for me and so i really um i was really kind of sad that i wasn't able to get like the full view of them um i also wasn't standing in the best spot until um carnographer no, Gorgatron was playing. And so I missed kind of like the best angles there and I apologize, but it was still an amazing experience. I got some great pictures of Coop Shoe, who was actually blocked the most by the speaker. Um, and another thing, our artists, our local musicians, you, you guys are so humble. It, that was amazing. So, um, Parthian opened the, for the show and they were amazing. They really set the stage. They really, um, prepared us for the rest of the concert and it, it started off amazing. I've noticed before that sometimes, like, the, um, opening band is not always as good as, like, the last band, right? No, this time, there was no, um, there was no... Uh, um, give me a moment to think of the word. Board, board moments in this show. There weren't any moments where I was bored ever. And Fluximok, okay, let me tell you about them. They're a bit of a different, um, the sound is a bit different compared to the others. Um, and even... Carthian's sound is a little bit different compared to Gorgatron and um, Carnographer. And so that experience, the entire show gave me um, a little bit of different, maybe not genres, but sounds. And I loved that. That was amazing. Um, so I really highly suggest that you go check out um, Parthian. They are amazing. They are out of Wichita, Kansas. And I really love just the energy. And the lead singer to their band is very humble and just incredible. Um, so I even um, teased the lead singer a little bit before they started playing um, about the type of beer they were ordering because... I told them that they were ordering a rookie beer because of the what it was. And um, they said, well, you know, got to stay hydrated. Hell yeah. <laughs> I get it. So then um, 
they just they have amazing music they have amazing material they have a good sound to them great sound quality um and lucas made sure that they're um in that all of their speakers were working well that all of their mics were picking up properly that was awesome thank you black heart booking for that um and then flux amok so the lead singer comes out with lufas on his titties right in a towel wrapped around his waist and a shower cap on his head and um scrub us um uh like a scrub brush shower thing it was amazing it really fit the entire just show for them and um this this band is just like I don't know how to explain this. They're just different. And um, they're a very, um, I love the sarcasm. I love the energy to Fluxamok. Thank you. That was fucking amazing. And um, they, this, they started out the song with um, like, uh, it was definitely about um, like uh, scrubbing. And uh, I, I don't want to, throw out the music because I feel like you really need to like go check out the music um but um it was scrub dub stuff so go check them out Flux Amok they're amazing it's F-L-U-X-A-M-U-C-K and then Parthian is P-A-R-T-H-I-A-N and then Gorgatron G-O-R-G-A-N I'm definitely misspelling that. Or G O R G A T R O N. I don't know why that's so hard for me to spell. And then Carnographer is C A R N O G R or G A R P H E R. Whatever. <laughs> I'm not great at like I can't spell that out right now, so you know whatever. It was an amazing experience, and um, they said something about um, Dr. Jacks being about the only place in Omaha that will book death metal anymore. That was awesome. So I really highly suggest going and checking out these different bands. Um, and I really highly suggest going and checking out just the different music that we have available in our community because whether it's this um, show and these musicians or others, we have amazing talents in our community to offer us and I guarantee you will enjoy your experience. So, um, I... Um, Dr. Jax was awesome. Um, this time they handed me a bottle of water. Um, I, again, I don't mind if you're going to charge me for water, and I'm definitely going to tip you, but, like, help me fit in with the crowd. Help me fit in with the other people who are ordering drinks. Um, uh, one of the regulars asked me, you know, do you want a cup of ice? I was like, yes, that would be awesome. So they helped me get a cup of ice so that I could pour my bottle of water in there I am looking forward to more concerts and I'm going to be attending more concerts with Gorgatron Carnographer and um, possibly Fluxamok if I can and Parthian possibly if I can if they're around again if I'm able to travel to them so I'm actually about to pick up my car today and um, so I'm going to be able to travel around to these different concerts especially in the area um and then you know um finances willing i'm gonna be showing up to some different shows there is a show coming up um that is viscerous and that is at therapy um that is at the therapy bar go check that out um go check out when that is i actually don't remember when that is but it's coming up here in the next like week or so so go check them out um jimmy scaffa has a 
um, concert happening on the either 20, I think it's the 26th of November or the 29th. I will be dropping down these links so that you can find them on my pages since I am mentioning this. Um, not my pages, my new Facebook account. Um, so everything off of my old Facebook account, I am not there anymore. I cannot access any of that. So go um, add me, follow me on my new account. I will be dropping some different concerts for you to attend and some different venues for you to attend. And I'm going to be going and checking out some different venues. I did get to hear um, a review, some feedback about the Admiral. So I'm going to go check that place out to see how I enjoy it and bring you back a review of that venue because um, they're I heard there could be some possible issues, so I'm going to go check that out for myself. Not so that I can um, reinforce these issues or that I can um, complain about any issues because I'm not trying to complain about anything here or and I'm not trying to like talk shit on anybody. So do not ever think that I am just giving my honest opinion about these different places and these different um events so um i want to go check that out so that i can give you my own honest opinion on that situation um on that venue because i feel like that matters um to me and i want to tell you about my experience so look forward to that um and then look yeah look forward to some other concerts and some other events that i'm going to be dropping um i did i did just get a ticket over at um for the jimmy scapa event so i will be there so this is one of your opportunities to see me in person um and to really um connect and i look forward to seeing you and i look forward to sharing more experiences with you soon thanks for watching this thanks for being here you can look forward to more reviews and um thanks for wetting my wiener with your favorite sauce i'll see you later